Yeah, better than I do. Any bonus? No six. Good. Yeah, solo shot. Just have a nice smile. That's all you gotta do. You got two different smiles. Just have a smile. Just look at the camera. Bam. Put a little six, like, watch. There you go. Watch, you're gonna have like a You're one of the lucky ones, bro. We got delicious tacos right here. We quietly have a collection of YouTubers over here. We got Dark Matter Wolf right here, Jake right here, Franchise right here, Post Dave right here, we got Hobby Gaming right here, Project Nation right here. I was gonna show you guys an excellent throw on a right horn, because that is like one of the hardest things in this world to do. But fortunately, I'm just gonna chat on this Mexican food instead. Ladies and gentlemen, the Pokemon Festival has concluded, and if you guys want to see all the awesome action that took place, go ahead and check out the live stream, and it'll be there for all of you guys. But first of all, we got to give a big shout out to our friends, our friends, our Pokemon Go friends at Sprint, and these were actually prizes that were supposed to be given away during the festival, but they arrived a little bit late, but we will have another opportunity, especially now that there's a Pokemon Go Community Day that's going on at the end of the month, but... Uh, would you guys like to introduce yourselves and tell us about your store in Santa Monica? Yeah, well, my name is Naxford, and this is... What's up, guys? My name is Ace. Come and check us out. Uh, pretty we're... much, uh, sorry, the, the store, um, they, they gave us a hashtag, Sprint Pokemon Go Guys. It's Sprint PKMN Go Guys. And they told us, um, get an Instagram, go out there and help the community, the Pokemon Go, take them, stuff like that. Of course, verify the, the level and just hand out prizes, get to know them, record with them, and get back to us um, in the intel to see how we can better um, support and help the community. They're try Sprint is trying to make Pokemon Go um, work, work, pretty much. They want to help you guys out. Absolutely, guys. I could not agree more. Sprint is the exclusive partner of Pokemon Go, so go ahead and check these guys out as well. And of course, we have special guests. We have Pokemon Master Holly. We have Sinbad. We have Saint Nick. And yeah, we now we're gonna go get our day started, continue with our mission. But big shout out to Sprint. Thank you so much for sponsoring the game and helping the game grow. Big shout out to you guys, and um, I will see you in the next one. All right, guys, real quick, coming to you from Brett, Sujita, um, LA, Artisan Noodles and Ramen. We're just picking up some food before we go ahead and hit, pick up some Pokemon at the pier. So we got Pokemon Master Holly right here. We've got St. Nick, and we've got Sinbad as well. And uh, we're about to have some super delicious food. And after that, we're gonna go ahead and hunt some Pokemon down in Santa Monica Pier. So, see you then. Sudden, we got a wild Snorlax right here in front of us. We're chilling, eating some ramen. I actually have something on my uh, face right there. 1,297 CP. Are we having enough to pineapple berry? We pineapple berry each and every single Snorlax that we get here on this channel. So hopefully, I can get it. Not the great throw right in front of the Snorlax. Again, it is is weather boosted, so this could be good IVs. However, let's see if we're gonna get a one hit a quitter on this beautiful, beautiful one shot on the Snorlax. I like check IVs. It's really caught my attention. Pretty decent. Pretty decent Snorlax. I may drop this in the gym. Um, let's name this Snorlax. What should we name this? Sujita. Okay. I can spell that correctly. Or ramen. I guess we're all LA ramen. That's what I was going to call it. LA ramen? 
All right, LA Ramen, welcome to the DX1 family. That doesn't look weird at all. Alright guys, so we just came across a really yeah, cool Japanese like collectibles type items of this store. This doesn't look weird at all. <laughs> so much different types of Pokemon merch imported directly from Japan. Um, Pokemon Master Holly, what is your opinion on all this stuff? It's adorable. Look at this Mew little pillow right here. It's a Mew potato. It's also a Mewtwo as well. <laughs> I just want to showcase all of this. There's a all of this, and also there's so much other Pokemon merchandise in this section as well. So if you guys want to take a look at all this, all of this guy's covers. This is most of this is awesome Pokemon merchandise. So they sell Pokemon cards imported from Japan. If I take a look at this, by the way, dude, this is this is a pin that my friend is telling me about. These are these are like the first, I think. Two of the first Mew, uh, Mewtwo, and Pikachu official pins. You know, you you can find you know, uh, Pikachu and Mewtwo pins uh, anywhere, but these might be the first two official ones. I'm not sure if this is what my friend was talking about, but it looks like it is. So, I was thinking about maybe picking one of these up. Really? Maybe. Sounds awesome, man. That's what you have. Um, you have the Mega Ring implications right here. So again, guys, a lot of awesome stuff in this little store. Oh, let's let's close out the clip with the chest spin right here. You can take a look at awesome Pokemon X and Y character figurines as well. Pretty awesome. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we are coming to you from the Santa Monica Pier. We're about to go right in. This is probably going to be the last raid of the day, but we're going to go ahead and take out this Kyogre real quick. And I'm going to go ahead, we're going to fight this bad boy. And first of all, we're going to get a little bit of thoughts and opinions on Kyogre. So, oh wow, who's, who's flexing the Mewtwo? Is that Holly? Who's flexing the Mewtwo? I'm holding mine for the last. That's why I have everybody, sh everybody should flex their Mewtwo who has one. Yeah, everybody should have done that. It's all good, it's all good. Yeah, it's got Blizzard, guys. It just demolished my um, Raikou. So this is actually my first experience battling a Kyogre with the move Blizzard. We battled Hydro Pump, we battled Thunder, but however, we have not battled Blizzard as of right now. No, he's not. He's not. Dark Matter Wolf, were you successful? No, it ran for me, man. Oh, it totally ran for me. Oh, did you try going raspberries? Oh, I did. Oh, okay. I should have Nana Berry. I, I, the last thing I caught was Nana Berry. And I just try to go golden raspberry. I thought I'd get more luck, but I'm try. I tried golden. I tried on actually nana berries to trap it in the middle, and then try to hit consistent great throws, and that didn't really work out too well. Okay, Pokemon Master Holly, were you successful? I'm gonna take a group pick first. Oh, you didn't attempt to catch it yet. Not yet. All right. I'm just going for it. Here we go, last ball. Jeremiah, we, right, let's see if Jeremiah last is ball. successful right here. No. Uh, no. Wow, man. it ran on like everybody. Let's see if All right. Oh, no. Yeah. Six. Darn. Bro. Sinbad. I only had nine balls. They're so high. That's, yeah. I use AR Plus. It's more easier. It is easier. I'm yeah. going to try next time. What's up? Were you successful Was in I catching successful? the Kyogre? Yes. I, I caught it on the second ball, and it was a critical catch. So I got lucky, guys. You see the, oh, Whoa. It, but I got lucky, guys. Mr. Elijah Watts, right here. Were you successful? Uh, yeah. <laughs> no, I, 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 I missed six yeah. balls in a row. It was the worst. Wow, I missed three. I missed three in a row. I only had nine balls. I hit the first three and it just... But now the pressure is on our friend Scott Wu, who actually has two balls remaining. Two balls. 22 98, so almost the same exact CP that I had. So this is a good Kyogre. I'm waiting for it to get to the side and I throw it. I, can, I cannot hit it when it's in the middle. That's like the same one I just caught. 
I have a good feeling about this. You know what? I'll go for it if it, if it attacks. No, okay, I'll wait. Okay. Scott, we'll hype in the chat. Oh man, guys. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. All eyes patience, on you. Patience. Go to the left. Go to the left. Next one. Next one. Okay, please attack. Please attack. Please. Work with me here. That's that's an attack. That's not attack. Don't force it. Oh no! This is it. No. Okay, attack, 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 attack. No. Go to the side. You can hear silence echoing through the stadium. Okay. Oh man, this is I don't tough. Like this guy. Hey guys, you need, you need yeah. <laughs> Kyogre requires a lot of patience. Good thing I like the better. Right? You know what? Okay, come on. Please. Please, guys. I'm You're nervous. You're down to just throw it? I might just throw it. I might just throw it. You won't. You're not down no. to just throw it, no. Scott? You won't. Don't give in. I need it. Uh, no. Oh, man. Oh, that's Switch. I mean, Dude. it might. Wiggle. Wiggle. Two. There we go. You got it. Oh! oh no! Yes, bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Bad throw, too. Scott, Scott. Yeah. Tell the chat how you feel. Yeah. Oh. Behind you all. Woo. Wow. What's the key, Scott? What's the key? Hey, did you catch yours? Um, the key is just screw it. Honestly, patience is the way to go because I can't hit it when it's in the middle. I can only hit it when it's on the side for some reason. So just wait. Okay. Just wait. Just be patient and you'll get it. Not everyone is so lucky, but Scott did manage to catch his. All right, well, clearly some caught there, some did not. We were not successful, but again, our Nana Berry trick didn't really work out the way I had planned. However, Gotta give a big congratulations to Scott for catching his Kyogre. How do you feel? I'm feeling great. Honestly, this is the first one that I caught on my own. Because uh, awesome. I, know, I know Elijah got caught mine the other time, but I got my first. There we go, guys. Now we continue our adventure. guys well we have a very special special guest we have uh, first of all we've got Saint Nick right here and then we got Pokemon Master Holly and in this segment she's gonna teach me how to actually do the export handler on the Pokemon Go AR plus mode which is coming to the channel this year probably around springtime I'd, I'd say around springtime we'll be Wilmer. working the AR plus what Wilmer. I should do Whammer I should do Whammer oh crap you know what I should have locked out of my um, I mean, does it really matter? No. Okay, uh, so we do Whalmer? Is that? Sure. Okay. Alright, so we got ourselves a Whalmer right here, and it's 773 oh. CP. So, um, I would definitely, once again, guys, the threshold, which is like a little bit under 600 CP, but I definitely suggest, um, using the Ultra Ball for anything over 600 CP, because then it has the ability to run away. So, we're gonna go ahead and activate AR Plus. Now it's going to say, make sure you're in a safe location while using AR Plus. And, wait a minute. Oh. So first step is to populate the grass. 
Okay. Now the Pokemon are always going to jump like five feet away from you. So if you direct it towards that gate, that's perfect because it'll show up like basically where that gate is. So you kind of like need to gauge it before you hit it, you know? Okay. So it says tap to find the Pokemon inside the tall grass. So as you can see on my screen, there's Whammer and there's the exclamation point which indicates that you are getting way too close to it. Oh God, I, Holly, I think you, what the? <laughs> okay, I think you might just no, because I, I saw the uh, meter go all the way up. I was like, is it, did so Holly just trigger that? When it first jumps out of the grass, they they know you're there, so they're scared. Okay. So now notice now you're okay. So now you can sneak up on it. Really all right. So now we're going to slowly but surely sneak up to it. Okay. Almost there. Like I like to take very very slight steps, and once you get the expert handler. You can actually, there, you there it is. We have the expert handler. Now, once you have this, you can actually approach the Pokemon from different angles, like so. You can actually get as close to it as you want to. And you can also hit it from behind. So let's go behind the Pokemon. Let's see what the Pokemon looks like from behind. This is pretty cool, guys. Look at this. I'm behind a big, gigantic whale. This is a little bit insane. You looking at his butt? <laughs> With no tail. With no tail. So let's go ahead and go in front of it since we can get as close as we want. I almost had the same CP as my tail. That's bad. Watch out, guys. Alright, so now we initiate the catch sequence. So I'm going to get a pretty comfortable distance. And what's interesting is catching it on AR Plus is extremely different than catching it on regular Pokemon Go. So I think I can hit it. So. Wow, look at how cool this is. It drops to the very ground instead of freezing the image. And there we go. Got it? There we go. Yay! That is how you do AR+. And we got, we caught Pokemon Master Holly, a Whelmer, 773 CP. She's got 209 Whelmer candy, so she's on her way to her, is that your Pokedex Whale Lord? Yep. Her Pokedex Whale Lord. Guys, that is how you do AR+. So, once again, Big shout out to the one and only Pokemon Master Holly for the instructions on how to use the AR Plus mode coming to DX1 this spring. Thank you so much, Holly. Thanks, guys. Thank yep. you. Sweet. This is a really interesting development. So, as you can see on my screen right here, we got ourselves a weather boost. I think it's weather boosted. I think it's probably cloudy. Let's see. Yep, a weather boosted 320 CP Chansey. And obviously, Obviously, we have to go with the pineapple berry, and we're gonna go ahead and rock the Ultra Ball and get the great throw with the pineapple berry. I've only caught a Chansey on my channel, like maybe once or twice. So, Santa Monica Pier definitely treating me really, really nicely, and I'm super stoked to catch a Chansey right here. 540 Chansey candy on the year. Yo, Santa Monica Pier, man, you stay lit. 